EA Sports to the game. easier to hit the ball standing there when you know where it's coming than it is when you're on the full run. So you got to test an opponent right away to see what he's capable of hitting the ball on the run and secondly, what type of fitness level he has because let's face it, as the match progresses and you start wearing down, it's tougher to come up with those running passing shots. Souvenir for somebody back in row 25. certainly hit it effectively. And we're off again. You have to be fit, you have to be sharp, you have to be agile, and you have to be able to do it for hours on end. Absolute peak fitness, these players. Oh, that was total reflex after that power serve. Clean winner. Get things rolling in your favor. Well done. Players today 
seem like they like to just go for the big aces, and it's great to have a high number of aces, but not if you end up and you look up at the scoreboard and you're losing the match. Because a lot of times players can just block the ball back. It's like a pitcher in baseball. You go out there and you throw a really hard fastball, people can catch up to it if that's the only pitch you have, so you've got to keep mixing it up. So a good tactic would be to actually hit to the strength, knowing that he's going, leave, then leave the whole court for the weakness to go into it. Exactly. Attack. Every oh. match I started, I would start at an opponent's strength to see what he had to offer, and I knew that the option was there to go to a weakness. Atmosphere at the U.S. Open like nothing else, is there? I mean, is it the New York crowd? I mean, I, I absolutely. I mean, Wimbledon is like the, it's, it's beautiful. It's, it's eerily quiet, but here, the noise can get you pretty easily, especially, especially the foreigners. You're not used to that. And I was lucky, Pat. I grew up in in Queens, which is where this tournament plays. So this is typical for me, as you can imagine, with the way I acted out there. <laughs> So she's not out of it yet. It's one break of serve. So it still has a chance to get herself back in the in this set. Well, she's got to do it soon. And they were underway again.
touching there. That's, that's a lot of touching to something like that. You need to work this second serve well. The truth is, you can pretty much write this set off. Hard courts was always my favorite surface path because I could stop and start on a dime. Well, I think that's an interesting point because there has been some great attacking players. Sir Volley has, over the last years, been effective on, on the hard courts. Even though there's no bad bounce, he's not going to kick up, no turn or run, or take a bad bounce or a bad jump. We've got such good grip around that, around that net. That, uh, I feel like there's nothing that we can't get. Oh, you said slide serve a perfect in position. Oh, that's just a gimme. Lovely smash. crucial here on this break point. Josh, he's uh, serving for the match. It's all about nerves now. Hope you dream about this position to get to a point where you're serving for the match. But she's got to step it up here and really focus in. That doesn't mean go for four aces in the next game. Let's get some good high percentage for a serve. Back in with her. She is something else.
that's the chance to try a couple different things. Test yourself, see what else is, uh, you can move from the practice court into a match-like situation. So, but it'll start you thinking, hey, maybe I can pull this off in a bigger event. Well, there's some thrills and spills there today, Max. Thanks very much for coming along. I certainly enjoyed it, and I hope the folks at home uh, enjoyed it as much as we did. Awesome work with you, Pat. I think we saw a real special match out there today. Look forward to seeing and working with you again in the future. To everyone out there, thanks a lot for watching. We'll see you soon.